went to last place, but Steve goes right back there. Couple of missed shots by the Racers. Red Hawks come out of their run, and here comes Marlin down the lane. Got bumped, scored, and the foul! Mar It'll be Simo's largest lead. It's in the air. Swish, 18-point lead. Let me say it again. Simo's up 18 on Murray with 10.43 to play at the Show Me Center. Here comes Isaiah Cannon dribbling right sideline. Pounding the rock against Lucas Nett. Gets a screen around it. Pulls up for a three. He's a great three-point shooter, but not this time. Got his own rebound. His follow hits the side of the backboard. Another rebound to Murray State. The finish and the foul. Seeing the way he played. Here's the next free throw. A little strong tipped, and Murray's got it. New player into the game, Chris Griffin, six foot seven freshman out of Tallahassee, Florida. Red Hawks are up 14 with 10-14 to play. Brister has missed three of his four free throw attempts here. So the lead could be larger. Here comes a dribble drive by B.J. Jenkins, finds Cannon, he can't connect from three. High for the rebound, Leon Powell. Big board by Leon. That's his eighth board to go along with 18 points tonight. So Leon Powell looking for a sixth double-double of the year. And to do it against Murray State would be huge. 45-31, Red Hawks by 14. And again, they are running shot clock and shortening the game. They're not stalling. They're just running clock and running their offense patiently. Marlon Smith got forced out of bounds by Ivan. as a front end of a one-and-one. Marlon Smith, by the way, is 12th double figure scoring game of steal. Here's Allison in for the layup. The lead is back to 16. So the Red Hawks turn the racers over. It's part of this game where the Red Hawks make a mistake, Eric, on one end. They usually atone for it on the other. And if you're going to beat Murray, you've got to do that consistently. Isaac Miles lobs to Asker, right post against Leon Powell. A couple of dribbles up and under move. Nice ball fake, and he lays it in. I don't know why they didn't go to Asuka more. He's been terrific. Eight points for Ivan Asuka, whose season high came back on December 11th, a 17-point game against Chattanooga. He's only been in double figures this year eight times. He's only started nine of their 26 games. Pretty talented to be coming off the bench. 47-33, a 14-point Red Hawk lead. 10 to shoot, eight and a half minutes on the game clock. Brister behind the back dribble. Tried to throw it inside, no look pass, threw it away. Ball tipped out of bounds off of Murray State. Just a pow shot at the shot clock buzzer off the heel of the rim from about 16 feet right baseline. Here come the racers in transition. B.J. Jenkins can't get baseline on Marlon Smith. Swings it out for Jenkins who finds Isaac Miles. Round his screen, pulls up for three. Rimming, rimming, won't go. Rebound pulled down by the butler. Eight minutes to play. Simo's up by 14, 47-33. It's a big part of Murray's game of those threes. They hit about seven per contest. They've only hit one all game, and it's part of the reason they're down 14. Todd, they're the number one three-point percentage shooting team in this conference. Number one in the league. Lucas, I don't know where he was throwing that pass, but it's... Isaac Miles for Murray State running the offense. Now it's Cannon. Cannon approaches, wing right against Marlon Smith around the screen, comes into the lane, and they reach in and strip. Daytona 500. We'll be back at Beefs next Monday for Red Hawk Talk. Official attendance tonight, 1,794 here at the Show Me Center, so just under 1,800. Small crowd. Isaiah Cannon, hook pass to Aska, fall away, five-footer, rimming, won't go, tip up by the racers. That would not fall. The tip by Dante Poole, but he left it short, and the Red Hawks have the possession up 14 with seven minutes to play. Lord Murray not shooting well, but the Red Hawks have a lot to do with that, Eric. They're challenging many of their shots, even in the block, and their second chance points aren't falling, and that's, again, a part of Murray's game. Everything going right for the Red Hawks so far in this contest. Let's see if Simo can get the ball to Leon Powell. Here is a collision away from the ball, and the officials let it go. Anthony Allison up in traffic. He had his shot blocked. Again, the Red Hawks did not get the ball to Powell. Here's Isaiah Cannon. Stops wing right behind the arc. Terrific three-point shooter, and he will miss the three. Came up short. Boy, he has had a tough shooting night. Their leading scorer, Cannon. 13 points per game tonight. Two points, zero in the second half. Red Hawks by 14 with 6.17 to play. 
Anthony Allison against Dante Poole. One hands it to the point for Powell. Bounce out wide right. The Butler. Cameron holding. Lucas not limping around on that sore right ankle of his. Works against Cannon. Now a switch. He comes in against the six foot seven Griffin. Fake the three. Now leans in and gets fouled while taking the off balance three. His third free throw. Rimming good. Oh, three big points. Simo's up by 17 with six minutes to go. The freshman Griffin out front. One hands it wide left. Cannon is on the bench, by the way. B.J. Jenkins plays catch with Isaac Miles. Isaac, free throw line penetration. Out to Jenkins, a three is good. B.J. Jenkins, just their second three of the night. They are two for 13 from three-point range, but Jenkins is one of their best three-point three shooters. Seventh in the league and made threes. He's made both of their trays tonight. 45 made threes. Lucas not trying to backdoor. Eric, and you're right, it's a nice break. So Red Hawks have gotten all the breaks tonight. They're doing everything right. This is a, a major upset in the making, and uh, it's been an amazing night so far. Here comes Marcus Brister into the paint. Oh. Flipped up the shot in traffic. No, did not get the whistle out of bounds. Looked like a good call, according to our webcast replay. Here's a post feed to Aska. He dribbled the ball off of his foot. Loose ball. It's tipped out by Marlon Smith. Anthony Adelson's got it. A tie-up is whistled. Possession arrow to MSU. The game, your webcast is just as good as being there in person from a proud Red Hawk cheerleader dad. Jeff Lennon assists his first year after transferring from Creighton. 50-38, it's a 12-point game with five minutes to go. Red Hawks in trouble, Cameron Butler in the backcourt. Dickey Nutt calls time. Hang on and pull off this monumental upset. Anthony Allison trapped in the backcourt, got it to Leon Powell who jumps it to midcourt for Marlin. Lead pass to Cameron in for the dunk and he is fouled this time. Wasn't a clean. Going from the line and they struggle some more. Butler missed them both. Here comes a driving runner that splashes home for Isaac Miles. Red Hawks miss free throws becoming a factor. Lucas Nutt into the paint, flipped it up in traffic, missed it early in the shot clock. Red Hawks by 10, 427 to play. Murray, this is the time where the racers in the pass will come down and stick a three and force you to call time. B.J. Jenkins, a three. Yes, there it is. timeout, there Dickie Nutt. Time. Leon Powell. Lead pass for Anthony Allison. Red Hawks will back it up and run the offense. Lucas not working against Dante Poole on the dribble. Back to the basket, works out high. Clears a little space and hands it off for Allison. Now it's Cameron Butler out front. Bonus time for the Red Hawks should Murray State foul anymore. They're at 10 fouls. Anthony Allison, wing left, comes down to the baseline, hangs in traffic, draws the foul. It's up. Anthony Allison with key free throws. The Red Hawks in the second half are just eight for 16 from the free throw line. Allison has not attempted one tonight, and he drills the first. And Allison misses the free throw. Simo's free throws are once again a major factor. Red Hawks have missed seven. I'm sorry, they've missed nine free throws in the second half of this game. B.J. Jenkins to the post for Aska, mismatch against Anthony Allison. He comes in, scores, oh. and the foul. Where was the foul? Where was the Woo. foul? Red Hawks work this hard. We come down the stretch, and you make a call like that? Am I hallucinating, Todd, That's or did horrendous. you see the same replay I just saw? Yeah, the same phantom foul. Well, the that replay you saw. shows there was no foul. 51 45. Anthony Allison. Charge with a personal, that's his second. Three minutes to play, here comes Lucas Nutt on a drive to the baseline, yes. leans it, banks it home! Wow, what a runner by Lucas Nutt! The lead is eight for the Red Hawks, under three minutes to play, here comes B.J. Jenkins in, scores! And the foul against Lee. 18 point lead is down to five, 2.50 to play. Anthony Allison in the backcourt here and he'll work it up against Dante Poole. Double team runs at him, throws it center of the floor for Butler and now it's Marlon Smith. 2.41 to play, Red Hawks by five. 
Marlin dribbles right side of the floor. Right in front of the Red Hawk bench, a handoff for Lucas Nutt, who plays out high for Cameron Butler. Now it's Allison. Anthony holding, 14 to shoot. 2.28 to play in this game. Red Hawks lead is five. They led by as many as 18. Allison around the screen, six to shoot. Five seconds, Allison fall away, 18-footer, yes! Oh. What a shot! What a shot! And they are on their feet at the Show Me Center. Here is a power dunk on the offensive end for Murray State's Ed Daniel. That's all right, you can trade buckets all night, Eric. The clock is ticking away and this five point lead is preserved. Under two minutes to play. Red Hawks by five, 55-50. Cameron Butler, a one hand pass for Anthony Allison. Allison, 28 feet away from the basket between his legs on the dribble around the Butler screen, curling left of the lane. 18 foot mark, picks up his dribble, 10 to shoot. Bounce in for Leon Powell, who had Daniel on his back. It's in the air, it is rimming, good! He got the kind roll. Here comes B.J. Jenkins. A handoff for Isaac Miles out high behind the back of the dribble, coming in, spinning into the paint, drop it baseline, a dunk for Ivan Aska! go length of the floor to travel for the Red Hawks. Marlon Smith throws it to the center of the floor for Lucas Nutt. Lucas into a double team, a triple team, got it tipped, and it comes to Butler, who's fouled, and Butler hasn't made a free throw in a rimming. He got it! Simo by six with a minute 14 to go. Isaiah Cannon, a handoff for Jenkins. He's at three threes here in the second half. Jenkins jumps it wide left for Isaac Miles. 24 to shoot, 104 to play in the game. Cannon jumps up a three, top of the key, rimming, won't go, rebound, Butler. Cameron's got to get rid of it. He's not passing. Butler edges one point against Murray in the previous meeting, and he rims in the second foul shot. Red Hawks by eight with 55 seconds left. B.J. Jenkins, top of the key, one hands it for Isaiah Cannon. Back to Jenkins, fake the three, into the paint, down the lane, got fouled. The best in the league made them both. Full court pressure. Red Hawks lead front of the racer bench. Lucas Nutt one on one with Isaiah Cannon in the backcourt. Now he gets stripped from the ball. It's loose. They throw it ahead. Here's Isaac Miles. Ball fake. Missed the shot at point blank range. It's tipped. It's picked up by Murray. Aska finds Miles out to Cannon. A three is good. Isaiah Cannon. Simo's best free throw shooters. Marlon Smith, Lucas Nutt. Inbounds play comes to Marlon Smith. In the backcourt, races up the near sideline, crosses midcourt, gets bumped, almost knocked down, no foul call. And now Marlon is fouled. How did they miss that foul? Makes no sense. 18 and double figures for the 12th time this year. Pounds home the second free throw. The Red Hawks by five with 18 seconds left. What a fabulous basketball game we've had tonight from the Show Me Center. Inbounds play, B.J. Jenkins across midcourt. Top of the key, into the lane, he comes, had it blocked by Powell. The Red Hawks have it, Marlon Smith. 10 seconds left and he's fouled. And the Red Hawks are gonna win it. Smith, it's in the air, he got it. This game is over, Eric. Pack your bags. We're going to Nashville. Start up the bus. 64 57. Missed three. Lucas has got it. The Red Hawks have beaten the champs. <laughs>